What makes something radioactive? Every atom has a nucleus that contains protons and neutrons. Here are all the different types of atoms known to man. Each atom is named according to its number of protons in its nucleus. For example, any atom that has a nucleus with six protons would be called a carbon atom. If an atom has eight protons, it would be called oxygen, and so on. All atoms are stable if and only if they have the right number of neutrons. This magic number of neutrons is different for different numbers of protons. Huh? I know this gets confusing. So to keep all this straight, chemists use a plot called the belt of stability. The belt of stability. Sounds nice. In this plot, all you have to do is look at the number of protons in your nucleus on this axis. Go up, and if the nucleus does not have this number of neutrons, uh-oh. Well, not that bad, but the atoms with that nucleus definitely are radioactive.